Hi, Shannon. This is Viola with Gwinnett SEO. Thanks so much for taking the time out to speak with me the other day, and thanks for clicking on this video. Now, I'm going to show you briefly three easy ways that you can improve your website so that you can start bringing in more customers. And if you're wondering why I'm making this video for you, it's pretty simple because there are a lot of business owners out there who just don't have the time to make the internet work for them, and it holds them back from hiring a marketing agency, especially seeing that they don't know who is an expert and who's not. So, I found that by making these easy free attack plans and giving them away for free, it allows some business owners to do this themselves. And some of them call me back and ask for some help. So if you want some help at the end of this, then go ahead and give me a call so we could chat. But if you want to do this yourself, please do. I'm just trying to help as many business owners as I possibly can. So now I'm going to talk to you today about content, backlinks, and citations. So first off, you have a pretty decent look. I love how bright your website is. You know, I love the photos. Okay, great photos here. I, I believe I saw a few calls to action. Here's one here. Definitely want to make these clickable. All right, or are they? There we go. Yeah, there's a few. I love that. Definitely great there. But um, keep in mind that Google doesn't care how good looking your website is, though. Google's main concern is to ensure that the home page, they like to see the home page having at least 1,500 words of content on it. Because when somebody goes to Google and they uh, type in roofing in coming Georgia, Google's job is to put them in front of the article that has the most words on it. And most likely these articles on the homepage of Google have at least 1500 to 2000 words on it. So you definitely want to increase your content on this homepage. Let's take a look at one of your competitors in coming Georgia, Dr. Roof. Okay. If you take a look here, um, on their page, you know, it's not as pretty as yours is at all. I mean, these photos, you know, it's not as pretty. However, um, they do have a little more content than you do on your page. And what's funny is they still don't have 1500. So that just tells us that they're definitely very beatable. So that's the first thing you want to get this upwards to 1500 of keyword rich content on the home page. And when people click on roofing and coming Georgia, usually they bypass the ads and they stop right here in this section called the map pack or uh citations and a citation is basically anywhere throughout the web where your business name address and phone number are listed throughout different directories such as facebook um yellow pages white pages yext the list goes on and on um, so you definitely, the strategy here is find out exactly how many citations your your top competitor is in any one of these three put yourself in those same three citations and I'm sorry, let's say, for example, they have 10 citations. Put yourself in those 10 citations and then add another 20, 30, 40 on top of that. So that way, you know, you are far surpassing them and it will be very challenging for them to come and surpass you after you get in the number one spot. And, and lastly, you want to put yourself... Um, as an authoritative content uh, in Google's eyes or as an authoritative website in Google's eyes. And the way to do that is through backlinks. All right, and a back, this is basically a tool that I use called RFs, and this allows me to see the back end of websites. A backlink is simply site A has a, has a link on it linking to site B. Let's say site B is FPI roofing. And the purpose of a backlink is to drive power, to drive traffic to another website. So. That is very important, but keep in mind that not all backlinks are created equal. So let's say, for example, if you are, if site A is a pizza company linking to your site, obviously Google knows that you guys don't sell pizza for a living. So it's not going to be as powerful as another site is uh, that has something to do with roofing or siding or something along the lines of the industry that you're in. So I went ahead and put that same competitor into this tool so you could guys, so you could take a look at what's working for them. Let's jump into their backlinks and see what we got. See, so for example, um, we got a few blogs. Boom, boom, boom. Best Atlanta Roofers. So expertise.com, that's actually a directory. That's a good one because it has everything to do with roofing. Um, Guild Quality is about Dr. Roof. Yellow Pages, 30 Best Roofing Contractors. So I actually will go ahead and contact each and every single one of these companies and pretty much get a link and ask for a link to be placed on their site for my site. So that way 
I know for a fact it's working for them. So whatever's working for them is obviously going to work for you as well. So if you're beating them with backlinks and you're beating them with content, you're going to beat them with their organic traffic and you're eventually going to start taking their organic uh, value, which is over $20,000 a month. So one other thing I want to go over with you really quickly are their keywords. Keywords are so important. So for example, Roof Repair Alpharetta, this says that 350 different people search for this particular keyword per month and they get 124 out of those 350 and they're sitting in the number one spot on Google. See how that works? Let's go ahead and look at another one. Roofing Alpharetta, Georgia, I know that looks similar, but completely different 250 people search for this per month. They are they get 95 clients from it per month and they're sitting in the number one spot for it. All right, I'll go one more. Roof replacement Alpharetta. 200 people search for that per month. 32 is what they get from it and they're sitting in a number three spot. So it goes to show just being on the first page allows you to get a good chunk, a good percentage of that 200. So I won't bore you with all this information here, but this is the type of content that you want to add into your homepage of those 1500 words. So again, Shannon, thank you so much. That's all I have for you. My name is Viola with Gwinnett SEO. Um, let me know if this video was at all helpful. I've been shooting quite a few of these and I would love to know if there's anything I could do differently. Um, thanks so much again and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Take care.